Hello, everyone. Welcome to today's morning English. This is Tiffany. This is Winter. 欢迎大家收听今天的早安英文 So today we're going to talk about three important words that you will often hear: vice versa, likewise, and ditto. Perfect. 我们今天啊就来讲讲在英文的日常对话里面三个非常常用但是又很特别很有意思的词 vice versa, likewise, 还有 ditto. 今天呢给大家送个超棒的福利，早安英文会员课程的七天免费体验权限，只有十个名额哦。同时呢，大家也可以加入早安英文的 Telegram 社群，来群里和我们一起交流。社群地址和七天会员的免费领取链接都放在评论区了，欢迎你来。我们先来说说第一个词 ，vice versa 吧。呃，很多同学可能还不知道这个词的意思。So let's start with vice versa. Okay, now vice versa is difficult to explain but easy to use. It means That what you have just said is also true in the opposite order. What? 就是说，呃、uh, ，你刚刚说的话反过来说也可以，反过来说也对。Yeah, it's not easy to describe, but I think it's pretty easy to understand with examples. Okay, do we have any? Sure. Now I could say she's angry at him, and vice versa. She's angry at him, and vice versa. Okay, 这个句子是什么意思呢 ？Well, it means that she is angry at him and he is angry at her. Ah,、uh, okay. So give me another example. Sure. Should we eat dinner then see a movie or vice versa? I got it. So you are asking if eat first then see a movie, or see a movie first and then eat. Exactly. Now notice that it's and vice versa, but sometimes or vice versa. It just depends on what grammar is correct. If you don't use vice versa, yeah. Should we eat dinner then see a movie or vice versa? 如果这样问啊，其实就是说啊， uh, 我们应该吃完饭去看电影，还是反过来看完电影再去吃饭呢？对吧 ？Or vice versa. 大家注意到了吗？当我们是在问句里面的时候，我们用到的是 or vice versa。但是当我们是用陈述语气的时候，像我们前面讲到的那个句子 ，She is angry at him and vice versa。我们用到的词就是 and and vice versa。Exactly. <laughs> Why don't you try one? Ah,、uh, okay. Hmm. The chicken comes from the egg and vice versa. Perfect. The chicken comes from the egg, and the egg comes from the chicken. Good job, <laughs> <laughs> and vice versa. Bits bits, you black. Very good. Okay, so what's the second word you wanted to talk about? Okay, it's likewise. Likewise, it's said when we agree with a statement, or a statement also applies to us. Likewise. Yeah. So I could say. Nice to see you, and you could say likewise. Yeah, here it's the same thing as saying it's nice to see you too. Ah, 其实 likewise 就是表示一样，我也一样。嗯，那这个用法我们平常口语里面用的多吗？常见吗 ？Oh, yeah, it's much more common than vice versa because it can be used any time you agree with a sentence. For example, if I say. I like blue more than yellow. You could say, "Likewise, 我也是 Right. Any time you agree, you can say likewise. I'm hungry. Likewise. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. So, 所以呢，总之就是，如果你要表示你同意对方说的，基本上就可以用 likewise 来表达。只是提醒大家，这个注意一个发音的小要点，就是这个词啊。它的拼写是 like l i k e 再加上 wise w i s e 这个词最后要发浊辅音 z likewise 声带是要震动的，大家不要发成了 s 的音，也是 likewise likewise. Hmm. All right. There's one more word I wanted to mention today. Okay, go ahead. Ditto. Ditto. 这个音好可爱，确定不是搞笑的吗 ？Ditto. Yeah. Ditto is used the same way as likewise. So if I say 
I thought the movie was great. I could say ditto, and it would mean I thought the movie was great too. Okay, 那 ditto 也是跟呃、uh, likewise 是一样的，表示同样也一样。那它的用法上和 likewise 有什么区别吗 ？Well, it's not really. It's just a personal preference. So I don't say ditto. I'm more likely to say likewise. But I have a friend that would never say likewise and often says ditto. One's not better than the other. Just choices and habits we all have. Okay, 那就是纯属个人爱好了。那你喜欢说哪个词就说哪个词好了。啊、uh, ，我个人是觉得 ditto 更可爱一点了。<laughs> <laughs> well, that's all the time we have today. 是的，今天的节目就到这里了。大家别忘了去评论区领取我们的福利。早安英文会员课程的七天免费试听名额，只有十个，先到先得。最后，大家如果想加入我们的听众群，也可以在评论区置顶找到我们的 Telegram 社群地址，欢迎你来玩。Thank you for listening to today's morning English. This is Tiffany. This is Winters. See you next episode. See you guys later.